Can you still make money with Pinterest affiliate marketing? Well, yes, you can, but you need to know what you are doing. So in today's video, I'm going to show you what you need to do. So make sure to watch this video very carefully. But keep in mind that most of the Pinterest users are middle-aged women, mostly moms. So first thing you need to do, you need to find a good topic and you need to find a good keywords. That is really, really important. So for example, when we come here on Pinterest and when we search, for example, for best, here we can see some suggestions. Best friend tattoos, best friend quotes, pictures, photos, song lines, and so on and so on. But also when I come, when I add 10 here in front, and here I can see even more ideas. The 10 best friend pictures for ladies, perfumes for ladies, best overnight odds, and so on and so on. When I press enter, I can get some ideas for my own article. Here you can see 10 most effective morning exercises for weight loss. Here you can see there are some other ideas that you can use. But because most of the Pinterest users are middle-aged women, mostly moms. So I wish to promote something related to moms, right? So let's just say, for example, I wish to promote baby thermometers. But I can't just go and write article about, for example, 10 best baby thermometers. Nobody is searching that. For example, when we come here on Pinterest ads and we search 10 best baby thermometers, here you can see nobody is actually searching that term. So what I need to do, I need to find a close keyword, keyword is, that is related to this product here, but that actually has a search volume. And I managed to find exactly that. And that is, does your baby have a fever? This is the correct way to measure your baby's temperature. Now, many moms with the first child, they have a lot of problem because it is their first child. They didn't have experience, they didn't have knowledge. So they went on the internet to find some tips and advices to see how to do some stuff. Now, this is really important, guys. Please, if you are going to write articles like this, please consult a doctor. I'm using this topic here just for the purpose of this video. Otherwise, I would consult some doctor to give me some tips and advices to help me to write this article the right way, okay? So, like I said, I'm doing this just for the purpose of this video. So what I need to do, I simply need to write an article. Now, for that, you can simply use Google Gemini. Now, here, I will tell it to write me an article. And I can say something like this. Write me an article with this title. Does your baby have a fever? This is the correct way to measure your baby's temperature. I used this as a title for my art article. And then press enter. And now Google Gemini will write this article for me. So next thing and really, really important is I need to create a Pinterest pin. From that pin depends, will I actually get traffic, free traffic from Pinterest or I won't get any traffic. So what you need to do, you need to go on Canva and then here you simply need to search for Pinterest pin. Okay. And I will click here. And now I also need to choose a blank because I wish to create my Pinterest pin from blank. So we'll click here and now I need to create my pin. And like I said, from this pin, everything depends. So it has to be as best as possible pin. So what you need to do, you need to find a good image. You can find good images, relatively free images on Unsplash, on Pixabay or Pexels. Now, I already did that to shorten this process. So I will simply go here on Uploads. And then here, I will simply drag this image here. Okay. And I will actually change the color of my background. I will use a red color because that will actually stop people from scroll scrolling. It will catch their eye. So now I will click here on this T for text. And I will choose one of these text styles. So let me just find it. Okay, I will use this one here. And then here I will delete this because I don't need that. Okay, simply click here. And then here I will say something like this. Okay, I will simply st say stop it. Okay, and I will give it like this. And I will make this wider just like this. And a bit smaller. And I will actually move this here. And I will make these letters to be white, to stand out even more, to catch even more people's attention. I will simply highlight this, click here, and now it is white. But I'm not done yet. I need a hook. So I will say something like this. And I will actually make this to be larger, something like this, okay? Make it larger. And I will actually make this to be bold, to make it stand out even more. 
and I will meet, need to make this to be a bit smaller, just like this, so you can fit in one row. And now I can make it larger. And also I will make these letters here to be white as well, because like I said, I need to catch as much attention as I can. And I will move this here, okay? And here you can see how this look. Stop it, you are doing it wrong. Now people will stop and see what they are actually doing wrong and they will see this image here that I will enlarge to make it fit, okay? Something like this. And I will move this image here, okay? So now people will see this, but I'm not done yet. I need to actually tell them what they need to read, okay? So I will say something like this. So let me just make this to be a bit larger, something like this, and a bit smaller like this, and I will make it to get into rows, okay? And I will move that here, and make it a bit smaller, and move it here, and I will actually make this to be in center, okay? Here you can see. And I will also change the color of this text here to be white. Click here and then click here. And now this text is white. And here you can see, stop it, you are doing it wrong. This is the correct way to measure your baby's temperature. Like I said, many moms who have a first child, they have many things that they don't know and they need to learn that. So when they see this, they will immediately stop scrolling. So I now have my Pinterest pin that will catch people's attention, it will actually make them click on that image, on that Pinterest pin to read my article. So all you have to do now is just go here, go back here on Google Gemini, and here you need to simply copy this article here that Google Gemini wrote for you, and you need to publish that article on your blog, on your website, on vocal media, on medium.com, on Facebook, on LinkedIn, or wherever you want. And also, how do you actually make money, right? You just wrote an article. Well, you can simply go here on Amazon and then here you can search for baby thermometers. Here you can see baby thermometers and then here you can find a lots of baby thermometers. So for example, I will open this one here. Here you can see this thermometer has 171,000 reviews, 4.4 stars on average. Now that is an amazing result because from this many reviews, on average, 4.4 stars. That means that this is actually a really good baby thermometer. So we will recommend a good product. So all you have to do, just click here on this text, and this is your Amazon affiliate link, right? And you need to add that link in that article. You simply need to write that article on how to measure baby's temperature, and you need to recommend this baby thermometer that you found on Amazon and that has 171,000 reviews and you will make money because when people come here and when they see the 171,000 reviews and when they read these reviews, many people will actually buy this baby thermometer and you will earn an affiliate commission. Now, usually it is 4% from this $17. So if you make 100 sales, you will make a good money. And all you have to do now is just go back here on Canva, click here on share, and then click here on download, and then click here on download again, and download this pin to your desktop. Then go back here on Pinterest, and then click here on create, and then simply click here to find the pin that you just created in Canva. This is the pin. And now you need to optimize this pin for your keyword. And that is how to measure baby's temperature. That is really important if you wish your, pin, your Pinterest pin to rank as high as possible on Pinterest search results. In one of my previous videos, I explained to you how to optimize your Pinterest pins. You need to include your main keyword in the, in the title, in the description, in the link itself. You also need to choose a right board and also you need to find a right tags that are closely related to your main keyword. After that, click here on publish and that's it. You will finish. You will publish your pin. Now, here is a really, really important tip. Now, probably you probably won't make that many sales from just one pin. But if you make 30, 40, 50, 100 pins, 100 articles, trust me, guys, you will start getting traffic, free traffic from Pinterest and you will start getting clicks on your Amazon affiliate links and you will start making sales. And eventually 
you will start making 500 1000 2000 dollars with pinterest affiliate marketing by promoting amazon products now i'm getting best results from amazon but you can also promote products from clickbank digistore 24 jvzu water plus commission junction or any other affiliate yes it takes some time it takes some work to do this but trust me guys in three four five months you will be making good money with pinterest affiliate marketing